Ooh, this is a close spot, man. Holy shit. Sevens, eights, and nines. I don't think he shoves tens or better ever. Oh. King! Yeah, baby, let's fucking go. Holy shit. Woo, been a, it's been a while since we made a nice little FT like this. I won't lie to you. Somehow we have 160 blinds and we're not the chip leader. I'm not really sure how that's managed to happen, but that's where we're at right now. Damn, Jace and I almost have the same bounty. Same with Lima. God, I picked up so many towards the end here. We did like a really long time in the, in the middle there where we didn't really get too many bounties. Damn, damn, son. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Speaking of which. Eight left now, guaranteed 3.5k plus the bounties. 10k score already. Oh, thrusty O with the prime sub, my man. Welcome, dude. Yo, Bloxamins, my man. Welcome back, dude. 28 months. And Flight Eternal with the Prime Sub. Welcome, brother. Eight hundred subs. Ayo, there we go. Pretty decent flop. I mean, we flop an open ender. I'm not going to check raise because I don't want to get into any crazy pots with like 100 BB stack, but we can definitely check call and be very excited about it. Hit the nuts on the turn, which is super cool. Not going to lead this because, I mean, it doesn't really improve us that much. It does a little bit more than him, but not that much. We'll just go for the check raise on the turn. Such a lame fucking river. God, talk about bad rivers, man. The eight and the six of clubs. Just fucking call... Let's fucking go, baby. That's a pot and a half right there. She probably had a set. Yeah, I was gonna say, what if we lose a set of kings here? Like, what if he just piles the turn and we lose to a set of kings? That'd be so sick, but. He didn't! What a lame fucking turn, man. I'd probably overbet a river. I'd probably. <laughs> pretty great turn. I'd probably overbet if the river was just like the two of spades, you know? I'd just bet like. What was it, like 360? I'd probably just bet like 480k and he'd just snap call. He'd never in a million years fold. I mean, not folding, but not really expecting this guy to be getting two out of line. But that being said, he has three bet an insane amount for being like deep in this tournament here. So, I mean, we just flop a couple of pairs, a couple of jacks, a couple of diamonds, and off to the races we go. Eh, I mean, 
his worst flops, but this guy seems like a C better, so he's probably gonna. Uh, maybe not. He C bet three to four times. See a 10 on the turn, yeah? That ain't it. I'm really sure what we're gonna do here. I feel like the answer is just a three bet call, but um, and this guy has been pretty fucking aggro in this tournament so far. That being said, it is the final table, and we are eight-handed, and he does have fifty blinds, so I'm really not too sure. I mean, I don't think we could ever fault ourselves for a three bet getting it in. This hand ends like right now, then it'll be fine. Fuck me. Come on, man! Please! Let's fuck go, Anna! Woo! Wow, stream delay is literally about to catch up as well. Ash was just like close to having to kill it, and I was like, yeah, dude. Literally seconds away. What a perfect fucking timing. We don't even have to kill the stream because we go on break right at the same time. What a genius, genius, genius way to go on break. Holy shit, man. Sorry. Hopefully things keep going our way. Length and delay? Uh, impossible without stopping the stream, so... Uh, if we do end up getting sniped, it would be the same thing as as just getting sniped or like it, it going all the way through and then having to stop the delay. So I will just lengthen delay if we have to. Otherwise, it's irrelevant, you know. Is he really gonna check raise here? Oh yeah, shit! Fucking who made who bet that I was gonna make the FT five to one? <laughs> and you actually shipped the bet, dude. Love it. Yo, lucky thirteen poker. Oh, host me with one viewer. Hey, thank you so much, man. Big, big, big fan of that. Thank you. Um, but six McNick on a real note. Thirteen months. Uh, welcome back, dude. Much appreciated. The Prosecutor with the two months, my man, welcome back. Kodila with the tier one, my man. And Jin567 with the prime sub, welcome, dude. Howdy Duda 86, my man, welcome dude. And A Dun603 with the five months, my man, much appreciated, brother. I'm gonna get shut down on rivers except for a four reduce. Do, 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 do. Do, do. But I mean he very well might be just like abusing my like playing of too many hands, you know?
my monkey tree. Probably has ace queen when he tanks like this. I don't think he ever folds like nines or tens. So, and I don't think he folds ace king. So I think he probably just has ace queen. Wow, Jack. So I tanked with that. Put a ten out there. Come on. I. Hmm. Even an eight, huh? Well, small setback. Small setback. I'm not really sure about that. He might be playing so tight because of. Uh, he might be playing so tight, just because I'm in the big blind and he's been playing pretty tight in general, but. I don't know if that means he, he opens so light that, like, eights is going to be super bad there. It's pretty unfortunate. We could have just called and probably gotten stacked post-flop instead. Since... Since it's going to go, like... Bat whatever call he probably checks the turn a bunch of the time and then i river a boat and i bet call the river and yeah so probably get stacked anyways to make ourselves feel better here but yeah we can also just call there not sure not sure in uh not on a final table just in like chip ev normally i think that's like a super reasonable shove it might be close I'm pretty sure we still shove that, like, in Chip EV. Just, like, if it was, like, a tournament with, like, 400 people left, we would shove. Um, for sure, I think. But I'm not sure. That sucks, though. Losing 600k is a pretty big hit. Lifted research with the tier one, my man. Welcome, dude. Really sucks if he gets it in here and we get free rolled, but whatever. Probably just chopping. Probably just chopping. Probably has king queen, king jack, king ten. If he had uh, like king nine or if he had king x of a of a suit, I think he gets in on the turn to free roll me. But maybe not because he wants to keep my bluffs in. Could have like jack ton of spades, yeah. Tomati, man, the four bet king. Holy shit, I forgot how much this guy four bets. I haven't played with him in a while. Ladders, only sixteen hundred bucks, smaller than some bounties we've taken, but you know, not too shabby. More than a I don't think so. I don't think so, but maybe. Kelly Chevy with the twenty dollars. Damn, dude, long time. Long time, dude. Thank you for the twenty. Austin De Haven still fucking sucks, man. No doubt about that. Stoic is Aries, we unbanned the kid and now he's sub. Uh, welcome, dude. I swear to God, if you fucking spoil, I will hunt you down in real life and. 
punch you right in the shoulder. Snap back without titty on it. Fuck. Connor Morenzi, my man with the prime sub. That's so, so shitty. I think with how much game I get all three bets, uh, we're not going to be making too many loose opens to try to hunt the bounty just because he three bets too much and I mean he's just actually exploiting us even though we have more chips and yeah. Alright, booty opportunity here boys. Let's get this one. You're so naive, you're so... I feel like a queen of diamonds is coming on the river. Hey! That's not it. That ain't it. Trying to think what to do if this guy shoves. Oh, he's disconnected. Okay. Something's up with stars tonight, man. Okay, I don't think he shoves tens. I think he shoves sevens, eights, nines, ace, king, ace, queen, maybe ace, jack. And if he shoves like fives, then it's definitely a call with the bounty as well. Ooh, this is a close spot, man. Holy shit. Sevens, eights, and nines. I don't think he shoves tens or better ever. Sevens, eights, and nines? What does he do with like fives? Oh. King! <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck yeah, baby! Let's fucking go! Holy shit! We'll be fine. Literally jumped to the chair, my your chair. Me too, dude. Like that's insane. We got flop dead. How much? How much equity do we have on the flop? Three percent. Three percent. I'm never that lucky. I've never once been that lucky. I mean, maybe once before, but like, oh my god, dude. I've never been that lucky. I was just like ready to go on break. I was ready to get up and fucking steam off here. 50 big blinds only left. So, you know, still heaps of chips, but still would have been steamed up. <laughs> oh, and it just comes king six. Like, excuse me? Excuse me? That's the kind of shit that happens to me. Not the kind of shit that we do to other people. He needs a heart. Oh, and he gets it. I, I like that for sure. I mean, listen, laddering is great and all, but having the only guy I think is a recreational left in the tournament win the pots, win the pot off of aggressive ass Tomati, I think that's like very good for us. This hits the small blind calling range super hard. I mean, he's gonna be calling like all broadways and then pocket pairs, you know? So like, the only thing that bricks here is like sevens through deuces, but everything else is gonna have hit, you know, like jack 10, queen 10, queen jack, king queen. Even king jack and king 10 have gut shots. We have the ace of diamonds, so I think this one makes, as a pretty nice check back. Um, and then yeah, hopefully we get a good turn. Hopefully it's not like a jack or a 10 or a king. Yeah, that's a pretty fucking good turn. This is insanely fucked up. He tanked a lot on the flop as well. Hmm. Uh, we're definitely not folding right now. I don't think like folding is uh, is a possibility, but maybe it is. Honestly, 
Maybe we just can assume that this guy like never has any two bet bluffs or anything. I mean, he honestly probably just has queen nine suited or pocket eights, and he's just being a super huge net. Yeah. Okay. Flopped it. Giant dead. Yeah. Maybe we can just fold the turn. Honestly. I think we have enough showdown that we check it. We don't need to bluff the ace of diamonds. I think that's a little bit much. What do you think the determining factor is deep run plus high density viewership across Twitch at the time? I think, uh, you know, whoa, cooler. It's nice, ladder is good. We take a shove to Maddie. Or a four bet. The four bet king over here. Aye. No action with aces, man. See what happens when Jays gets aces? He gets in versus kings. When we get aces, folds. Fucking rigged, man. Nobody runs worse than us. <laughs> that was pretty cringy. I'm sorry, chat. Oh, wow. I was going to say, he, he, he must have just shoved. Makes sense. All right, we defend the big blind versus min-raise versus the wreck. We're going to check call and probably check call the turn. I think our hand's probably a little bit too strong to, to check fold. I mean, second pair and a, and a spade, definitely never folding versus that size. I mean, it, I feel like that size is maybe a little bit more value heavy, but... Uh, I think that it's just too good of a price. And, yeah. We'd love to see a check and just get shown ace-queen with a spade. I mean, if he bets the river here like 130, I'd, mo I'd be more inclined to call like 300k than like 120, I think. Hmm, this... This, this feels closer... This feels closer to uh, to 120. Yeah, I, I realized while I was thinking about that uh, and just, yeah, just thinking about that, that he, I don't think this guy bets a king three sheets for value, like, ever really, so I think his range is basically polarized to flushes and, uh, you know, bluffs, so not that I think he has an insane amount of bluffs or anything, but he basically has to have flushes, we have a spade blocker, um, and I think that the turn and the river want a bit bigger with a flush for the most part, so I think this is, like, definitely a super reasonable call. And it's all it's it's all good, like that we lost. It's not really a big deal, I don't think. I'm like very, very A okay with the call. Our Egyptian with the ten months, my man. Him and Kmart both fellow streamers here. Recently our Egyptian scored hundred K in the mill ball. Hold? Nice. I mean we ladder at this point laddering well, I'll take laddering over like Jay sticking around for the booty. For sure, for sure, for sure. Alright, man. Fifteen and a half K locked up and eleven and a half K in bounties. That's a chair giveaway. That's a chair giveaway. I mean, it's not quite there. It's 27,000, but that's a chair giveaway. If you guys know how other streamers do giveaways in Twitch chat that isn't uh, Chrome,
Please just check. <sighs> please just check Tomati one time. Please, please, please just check. Nice. Um, I think like 97 times out of 100 we have the best hand here. But I do think he can check like ace-10 and ace-jack sometimes on the uh, river here. So, And I don't really think that we get called by too many worse hands. So, just take it. Whew. Would have been nasty if he shoved, but let's fucking go. That's a really nice spot. All right, I got some subs to get through here in a second, boys. Great bluff with the prime sub, my man, Captain. On deck with the sub, my man. Today was a good day. This guy did that weird clicky back shit earlier. I mean, maybe this is a little bit too much, but we have a pretty good hand. I mean, we don't really have a ton of like value on that board, to be honest, apart from like 8x, but yeah. Bruce Jenner with the sub, my man. Adam Yid, my man, and DH Freeman 94, my man. That's pretty unfortunate. Maybe we should have checked. Probably should have checked. Mm -hmm. The real sep with the prime sub, my man. Welcome, dude. God, we might hit 1k subs tonight. How many are we at? It's been a while since we were at 1k, honestly, boys. Pretty fucking good turn. Pretty good board. But we do a chair giveaway. We give away a DX Racer. I'm just going to get it in. I'm just going to get it in here. Uh, we give away a DX Racer. Uh, and... Everybody can enter the giveaway. We'll take sub mode off when the giveaway is going on. Anyone can enter, but subs get a uh, 10x sub luck. All right, let's get there. 46%. That's a bad turn. 10! <sighs> That's unfortunate. Yeah, I mean, he raised a couple times over limbs. I don't... Uh, I think it's just like... I mean, we had 46% against Kings, you know? And when we when we get folds, it's obviously amazing. There's lots of bad turns for our hand. I think it's like a definitely a pretty good get-in. 46% against an overpair is pretty nuts. That is unfortunate, though. Would have loved to get heads up and just go heads up fucking 3 mil versus 4 mil. Definitely would have been better. Wow, dude, that was a quick one. This is gross. I mean, yeah, it's a pretty easy call, but, like, if the club doesn't roll off, like, it, when when he... He doesn't have 7 5. He has, like, 6 is 4 is a 6 is 4, obviously. Those are his value hands. All right, I call any bet, unless he bets, uh, unless he shoves. In which case, I think I'll fold. But I call any any other bet. I think. <laughs> Let's go. We got it all back and then some. God, this guy's crazy. How does he not barrel the turn, man? 
I three by jam versus a lot of opponents, but not this guy. I'm just gonna check all three streets if he has a better hand than good for him, you know? Unless like the Jack of Diamonds comes, in which case I'll consider folding. Wow, what a great river as well. We counterfeit all of his better ace -X. Only lose to ace king, pocket kings, and six X or sixes. A6. Six. A says total air ball. Oof. That sucks. Eight or six. Come on now. Six! Eek. Jeepers with the Prime, my man. Beat Zero, the HP Garage with the Prime. Welcome, dude. And Petros with the Prime sub. Welcome, brother. Wow, half pot? We have the Seven of Diamonds, though. How can he have combo draws? Pretty good run out. I mean, this guy's shown that he can check some strong hands, right? I mean, I wouldn't say that he can never have a flush, but I would say we have the best hand the vast majority of the time here. And if he bets, I will shove over top as well. Let's fucking go, baby! Booty and heads up! It's cello time, boys. Check it out.